Holly and Kayla with Never Quite Perfect, the channel all about drinks, tea, and cocktails. And apparently my dogs are going to fight while we're doing this. You two, stop. Shooky is going to join us. So tonight we have a tea review from some Sips by Box at some point. This was in my stash. It is a Tea Goblin Tea. Aren't these packages so cute? Yes. This is the Piquant Peach. A redemption story. The teas, the spices, the apples, the quinces, the lemons and oranges, plump unpecked cherries, melons and raspberries, bloom down cheeked peaches, swart headed mulberries, wild freeborn cranberries, crab apples, dewberries, pineapples, blackberries, apricots, strawberries were but a humble offering in that market centuries ago. We goblins are here merely to ply our wares, the succulent leaf potions we conjure up in our forest. Come taste, come taste. Inspired by the poem Goblin Market by Christina Rossetti. Ingredients, organic apple, organic rosehip, organic white hibiscus, organic sweet blackberry leaves, organic roasted chicory root, natural flavoring, organic peach, and organic marigold. I seriously love this packaging. It is so adorable. Yes, see me. I saw you put ice in there. I like ice in my tea. It smells. This tea smells so good. I didn't get this smell. Smell that. That's snot in it. Mm. Weirdo. Well, it's hard for me to smell things, man. Because you're snotty. No. Here is the tea. It's hot. Like it. So this is a tea that you can get exclusively at sipspy.com in case you're looking for it. It's good? Yes, I like it. This girl loves peach tea, loves it. Like in the tonight summer, I was craving one. Yeah, tonight she was craving it. It's, we drink it more in the summer. I do it a lot as an iced tea in the summer, <laughs> which by the way is really good with amaretto cream, but anyway. Sorry, I didn't mean to fall off the bed. Mm, that is really hot. It's really good, but hot. It it's is put ice hot. cubes in it. I feel like it could be stronger though. Like I should use more tea. Like more creamer. <laughs> more creamer. There's no creamer in this. I know. <laughs> I feel like I should have. I used one tea scoop. For this we should have used two. I feel like I should have used two more. Two. What do their instructions say? Measure one and a half teaspoons per eight ounces of water. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So that's where I messed up. I yep. didn't read the instructions. Bad. <laughs> Bad. What, what am I touching? <coughs> there I go coughing again. My Stupid mother cough. is bad. She cannot behave herself and read the dang instructions. You could have done it. Shh. Mm -hmm. That's what I thought. No, because you make too many cheese. I make too many teas. And usually, I like more sugar in my teas than you. Like, a lot more. Too much sugar is not good for you. Yeah, no, I know. I really do it, though. I just put a little bit of sugar. I put, like, about two teaspoons. You're trying to wean it back to no sugar. What? <laughs> well, I ain't doing it. <laughs> Sugar's not good for you. Right, Shuggy? <laughs> Our puppy's name is Sugar. Kind of funny. So she came with that name. So one day we're just gonna She's get sweet. rid of sugar if we're like totally getting rid of sugar. Not my baby. <laughs> She's my hike buddy. She and I love to hike. It means you fall off the bed. So this one is still very hot, but it is delicious. I still think I like the Bigelow peach better. What do you think? Huh? What Bigelow peach? The one I use in the summer to make iced tea. Do you like that one better? Or I like one? that one as an iced tea better than in this one as hot tea better. They're different. They are different. They, they are, are different. It's totally fair. One's an iced tea, one's a hot tea, so they're different. It's totally fair. Can you make more peach tea? What, like iced tea? There's pumpkin iced tea in the fridge right now. Yeah, it's because it's peach. It's pumpkin. So that is it for this a tea review and our tea ramblings. <laughs> Don't forget to like and subscribe to see our other tea reviews. Mm -hmm. Thank you for watching and we'll see you later.